We're back in St Andrews and this week it's Fulham and it's a really cold day. It's wet and about five degrees, so not great, but always good for football, I suppose. Anyway, the big news for Blues this week is that uh, Holly Dean, our captain, is out after his three-match ban, so Dukey is captain, uh, but in Harley's place is Jake Clark Salter, who I don't think has actually started a game for Blues, apart from the pre-season match against Brighton, so he's a little bit untested, so it's a big challenge for him. Uh, the other big news is we signed a striker. Well, a left winger who is also a striker. Um, Jeremy Bella, or Jeremy Baylor, however you pronounce it. Uh, he's on the bench. Now, he may come on. He's actually been with Blues training for about three weeks, so he could well make an appearance. We lost 4-2 at Cardiff. Fulham lost 3-0 at home to Hull. So, oh, I don't know. Oh, my prediction was massively out last week as well, if you saw that one. Uh, I'm going to go for 1-0 to Blues. That's absolutely guaranteed to be wrong. Anyway, miracles happen. Keep right on, everyone. Not much in the highlights reel from the first half because there wasn't a lot to highlight. Uh, essentially, both sides have had a few chances. There's been a lot of play in the midfield and not a huge amount has happened, apart from a bit of pag between, I think, Mitrovic and Bellingham towards the end. Yeah, so we've created quite a few chances, but again, not put anything away. I'm, I'm getting a little bit excited that uh, Jeremy Bella, Baylor might... You got a cheer. Might uh, might make an appearance, but uh, we need to pick it up. We need to be a bit more incisive, a bit more decisive. Uh, Fulham could have got a few goals, so we need to be careful. Second half. I'm hoping we'll get that a vital goal to give us the win. But it's going to be a close one. Keep right on, everyone. Uh, Blues nil, Fulham won. And to be honest, I think that's just a case of uh, taking your chances. Both sides had chances and Fulham took theirs. And I'm not sure if it was a mistake by Lee Camp. Uh, I, I couldn't really tell, but it may have been. Uh, but either way, uh, they took their chance uh, and, you know, they, it was a deserved win, I guess, in the end. Um, certainly after the first half, it was, it was pretty even. Second half, we, we sort of, we got better, but we certainly put in a lot more uh, creative effort after after we conceded um, and and Pep went for it we brought on uh, the new signing uh, Bella uh, we brought on Jimenez and we then brought on uh, Jefferson Montero so it was sort of an all-out attack and uh, there was a lot of, of some really actually really great midfield players some lovely moves 
but it just wasn't finished off by any sort of killer instincts. It's international break now, a bit of chance for everyone to get used to playing with each other um, and hopefully we can have a slightly more cohesive, um, incisive, aggressive attack away at Huddersfield. In the meantime, keep right on everyone.